somebody out there? Recently, I visited a friendly little gold rush town in Northern California called Placerville. There are lots of shops and places to eat there, but there is also another side to this charming little town. In its early days, it was also known as Hangtown, which brings me to my recent stay at the Carey House Hotel. Built during the 1800s, the Carey House Hotel has gone through many renovations. Today, it's a nice, comfortable place to stay. Up these stairs, down this hall, and beyond this door in room 205, called Ujule, is where my ghost hunt story begins. Okay, so this is Spider Wayne at the uh, Carey House, October 31st, Halloween. And um, I have the lights out just so I can uh, use the infrared and the full spectrum of this camera to see if there's anything here. Right now, this is being recorded through... Um, a Sony camera that's been modified with a filter removed so that it becomes a full spectrum camera and I have a full spectrum light and an infrared light on the side of it so it can see in the dark. Okay so back here I have a recorder, a zoom recorder and um, I forget what that's called, I'll put a note here but it's uh, checking for AM FM signals because people some people believe that spirits can talk to you through those frequencies so I'm using that to see if I pick up anything and what else do I have? Oh I have this here to uh, check for electric magnetic fields as long as it's in the yellow that's supposed to be safe it's in orange it's in the middle which is probably well that's yellow actually that's supposed to be safe, but what's weird is that that wasn't showing up earlier today in this area. So, like that in the doorway, I thought it was the smoke detector, but I guess not. It goes out around the bed, so, um... This thing is flashing in the red. I don't know what's going on. There's Scary Girl. She's manning the recorder and everything over there. This thing is flashing in the red constantly. Was not doing that at all earlier today kind of freaky. Okay. It stopped. There's a story about some guy that used to work here. Apparently this place has been here since the 1800s, but there was a guy that um, worked here and he wasn't uh, very attractive, so the ladies didn't really like him too much. But uh, he would flirt with them. And apparently he kind of like the guys too so and he flirted with a guy he flirted with a guy and and on the stairwell and the guy wound up stabbing him and killing him so that's one of the ghosts that they say is roaming around this place i don't know if you can see i'm going to turn on the infrared light let me make it dark in here so you guys can see what's going on All right, infrared light. You can kind of see, <laughs> not very well though, huh? All right. See, see how it changes? And I'll put the uh, full spectrum light on. So, okay, I'm gonna turn this stuff on. Stay with me. Hello! Hello everybody! How are you all doing tonight? Ooh. 
Oh, a fur ball. Guys, hear that? First prize up. It's an apple. Shuffle, which I gave away once before. You get to pick whatever color you want. Hmm, hopefully, I say this right. Jarment Jarmentra. Hello, everybody. Whoa. Hello, everybody. Whoa. The heck is that? All right, if there's anybody, if there's anyone in here besides me, go ahead and say something. I seen anything? Come out, come out wherever you are. Anybody there? Who did that? Where should I go next? Should I go to the East Coast? Maybe uh, there's more activity out that way. I don't know. I'm going to have a partner on the next one, and we're going to take turns talking to you guys and doing walk-arounds. Maybe I'll even go out in the hotel, because this hotel here, they lock it up at 8 o'clock. Um, and everybody, everybody's gone. There's nobody around. So I could walk around and it's kind of neat. The hallways are nice and long. The lights are kind of weird. It's kind of spooky looking. You got to take the stairs. There's no elevators. So it's a very old place. So you got to take the stairs down and they kind of go around and around. So it's um, kind of creepy. And it's very, It's like I said, this place has been here since the 1800s. So it's, it's pretty spooky spooky environment. It's, it's really nice looking. It depends what frame of mind you're in. If you're thinking ghost, then it's spooky. But if you are not thinking about ghosts at all, then it's, it's a pretty nice place. And the staff here is excellent. They're great. They're really, really nice. Really nice people. Sky Marks, are you still here?
Okay, I think my mind's playing. Whoa! Oh, jeez. I think my mind's playing tricks on me. I thought I felt something like touch my ear, and then I thought I saw something out of the corner of my eye. All right, man. Uh, 3 a.m. on the East Coast. You have a good night, and uh, stay sub stay subscribed and tell your friends to to come along and uh, subscribe to my site, my channel. I'm kind of shaking up. Can you hear my voice shaking? Huh.
Hmm. <laughs> you know what I'm going to do? Susan, I'm going to turn this monitor down. See what let's see what we get. You guys wanna see the room? Let's see if I can show you the room a little bit. You guys see anything? Let me know if you do. There's the sofa. That's with the infrared light on. That's with the infra light, infrared light off. It's pretty dark in here. I'll turn it on again. And then this is with the full spectrum light on. It just gives more distance.